got my, he's got his hand on his back. All right, he's got he's buried his way. He can even come out to the side if he wants you. All right, the one thing I don't want to do here, tighter, tighter. Punch, punch your elbow in tighter. Slide your elbow tighter. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The one thing I do not want to do here, and this is a natural tendency to do, is start to put your head down and start looking the other way. Because that's just basically giving him the pressure he wants. He wants my shoulder pressure to go down so he can stick my ear, my, my shoulder right into my ear, right? Tomorrow he's, he wants to drive up, stick my shoulder right in my ear, right? That's the one thing he wants. So this is a fight here. Everything on bottom is a small little fight. It's a micro fight of a bigger fight. All right, so we're going into the bar. We're gonna start looking into it. The first thing I wanna do though, I wanna start trying to work. No, don't move. I gotta release some of the pressure. He's got a lot of pressure on my arms. He's putting his pressure on my back here. And if he's got my arm extended here, that's fine. Cause I can start pushing him back here. And I got my elbow jammed back. You don't like that, do you? You see that, I got my elbow jammed back. He doesn't like it. So I gotta get the pressure off me here. Number one, I look into the bar. I'm not looking away, so I start looking in. Two, my inside knee comes up. This should look really familiar to you guys. When your inside knee comes up, right? Because what it's gonna do is gonna release some of the pressure that's on top of me. So when, that when I start getting my inside knee up, my bottom leg starts coming in, and I just start turning in. He's not gonna stay, if he just stay, don't move. If he just stays here, this is what's gonna happen. He's not gonna do that though. He's a good wrestler. He's going to move. All right. Number one, the inside knee's gonna come up. I'm gonna start looking back. I can get my arms long enough. Some of you guys have long arms. You can push back on the thigh. Bring your thigh back in. Keep it there. Keep it there. I can push back. And I can start turning in. Now, the one thing, he's not gonna fall off like he did the first time. All right, he's gonna stay with me. Stay with me, 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 stay with me. Look at that. Now from here, I'm pretty much out. All right, I'm here, but I don't want to keep coming up with him having that bar. So I'm gonna go, now I'm gonna shoot my body back forward, all right, and lift my arm out. And now I can start catching my hand, catching his hand. Coming out, Bonnie. All right. Sometimes that thing will come all the way free, though. You have to release the pressure. You're not gonna do this if you just bring your chest up and turn. What do I gotta do, Alec? He doesn't move. What's, what's the first thing I gotta do? Yeah, push back. Yeah, the bottom leg comes through. I, just, look at that. My bottom knee starts coming through. And now from here, look, he's going to follow. He's not gonna stay here. If he stays right here, he's gonna hit by stick. He's not gonna do that. Well, he might. If he's tired, if he's not really paying attention, he might just stay there. Alright? So he follows him. Like, like, tighter, bar tighter, bar tighter. And this only works if you got a good bar. So don't flop around here, down here. So I'm gonna look in, push back, bottom leg comes through, push back, push back, push back. Now I can keep turning, now look, position is this. What position am I in right now? What's it look? What's it look like? What's it look like? What's it look like? What is this look like? No, I'm drag. You gotta identify those positions you're in. That's what will happen if you start to do He possibly does a cartwheel over, like you see sometimes, right? They will, some people will cartwheel over. But anytime you have an underhook, you split their body. It's the same thing as this. Can you get through my arm right here? He can't physically go through my arm unless you let go. Now he's behind. Alright, so when we get here, we're gonna split his body. It's almost, it's just like that underhook. Bottom leg comes through, he's circling. Now watch, you see how I, I'm gonna keep rotating in and dump my head through. See how I kept spinning? A lot of times I'll just be here on a single. Come back. A lot of times I'll just be here on a single. But sometimes if he's spinning hard, he's spinning hard. You're gonna end up right here. What? All right, basic turn position. See, so this is the, the principle here. You cannot stop and put your hand up. You cannot stop moving. Everybody have this one? Want to move on? Let's do it a little bit longer. He's got the bar locked. What's your question? Yeah. He's got the bar locked up. 
Look back into it. I put a push on his side. If I'm like through, I can push it back. Now look at this. My inside knee is down. I'm going to switch. Switch, switch, switch. See how I can tuck my hand 